Bye bye Milan. So I accidentally bought this coffee, but you need you need to use it like with one of those kettle things. So I said to the cleaners, they can have it. Finally on the train. <laughs> they used to like Made it to Florence about two hours later, and we finally rocked up now. So, uh, apparently, our hotel is like walking distance away, so I think we're gonna just walk to our hotel, and then that's pretty much it. So, I'll see you when we get there. Um, I don't know, brother. This thing taking us the weirdest way. This is fucked, lad. All right, so BB Hotels. That's where we're staying at. We just um, try to check in, but our room isn't ready till two. And the time currently is probably like oh, 12.43. So we got about an hour to sort of walk around and do something. But the area is quite nice, actually. Looks real nice. So these must be like new buildings. Like They must be sort of new. But they keep the old style kind of look. Which I really like. like look at that. That looks cool, eh? Oh my god, bro. Look at that. <laughs> Yum. So just had some lunch. Go for a little stroll now while we wait for our hotel. But there's a, quite a few good like little food places behind me. A lot of like Mexican like taco places and stuff. But where we're staying is so nice. Like it's a real quiet little sort of town. Like this is peak hour time as well. And there's like pretty dead streets, I guess, which is good. Like, yeah, this place is nice. Blah, blah. So this is our room. Just come in here. Oh, yeah. This is well cheeky. It's not too bad at all. So... Yeah. Oh, my fuck. Do that again. Oh, my God. Actually, looks quite nice though. It is, it's really nice. Not sure. Yeah. But the best part about this, you get free coffee, and they actually got a coffee machine here. So they got pods, little Nes Nespresso machine, and a Espresso glass. That's pretty nice, actually. Wow, that view is slight. Is it <laughs> shit? Oh my god, bro. Welcome to Italy. Well. Alright, well, we got no fucking view on this room. Oh, I guess these are staying permanently shut. No, you don't need to live in dark. Oh. It, it is what it is, bro. It's not the greatest, but it will do. Yeah, you're gonna just make do with what you got, to be honest. Yeah. Okay, why is it aircon 26 degrees? Alright, so time currently is about 4 30. We got dinner booked at around 7. So we're, um,. Just going for a little walk now, check out some things, and then, um, I guess, yeah, go to dinner. So, I don't know. I don't, I think we're just walking just for the sake of walking. I don't know what we're actually going to look at, but so far, Florence has been pretty nice. Haven't really done too much, but there's a lot of cool places around us where we're staying, close to everything, which is good. Yeah! I don't know what this lake's called, but. We were told to sort of walk along the lake. Lake line is the safest route. Not that it's like dangerous or anything, but um, apparently at night time, obviously like walking through a, sta a train station isn't really what you want to do, no matter where you are, even in Perth and shit. Just Perth, we're comfortable because that's where we're from. But yeah, this place is pretty nice, eh? I reckon it's been some alarm so far, just in terms of like, a lot of cleanliness and 
feel like Milan was just really packed, obviously, because it's like a main area. Like, Rome is going to be nuts. You have to do stuff in the morning, have a nap or something, and then go back out in the afternoon when it's a bit quieter. But yeah, oh, damn, this it's pretty cool. I want to jump in there. So hot at the moment. Like right now, as I'm recording this, it's 37 degrees. It's absolutely cooking out here. And then tomorrow it's 38 and we're supposed to go to a wine tour. It's gonna to be so hot. We're, he we're heading to like Tuscany um, to, for like the wine tour. That's pretty cool though. Quick lemon slushy. This is actually really yum. And then we're at this fucking, I don't know where this bridge is. Apparently it's like where everyone goes and there's like heaps of shops and stuff in there, but. I don't know, I guess we'll see. Damn, bro. That's sick. It actually looks sick. And then there's like all these other ones along there with all different like jewelry and shit. So we made it off the bridge. The bridge was cool. There's legit so much jewelry. I reckon I'll end up buying something. An uh, iced out chain or, or like a ring or something would be cool, but see what happens. And I think she wants to buy something as well, like a little pendant or a chain. But I don't know where we've ended up. Oh, there for your Christmas tree. That's actually sick. Brother, I don't know what that is. Church, but that is fucking sick. Where? Oh my god. So dinner was pretty good. Still didn't beat that shrimp cover. Oh my god, what is that little dog? Look at this little dog when we walk past it. I didn't record it, record it, but we had a um, tiramisu, I did, she had an apple pie, and then I had like a small espresso, um, but yeah, the food was pretty good, way different to like Perth, so, like, it just tastes way different, she got a lasagna, I got a, um, a penne, I don't know how to say, but it's like a bolognese and like um, creamy sauce, but yeah, it was good. Good morning. So it's currently the next day. Um, I've completely forgotten what day we're up to, to be honest. I think it's been almost two weeks. So probably like close to 14 days. Um, you'll see it anyway, before I started speaking. But um, we're supposed to go to a wine tour today, but we ended up scrapping that. And we're just gonna do like a bunch of shopping today because we only have a couple days here, so. We've got something already booked for tomorrow, so we would legit have no time to like do shopping or to do anything, to be honest. So we're going to free up today to sort of do what we want to do, to go shopping and shit. And then, um, yeah, might end up buying some jewellery or something. So keep you updated. Just about to get some breakfast now at this little cafe. Legit like just around the corner, which is good. And yeah, I'll see you soon. Breakfast done. On the way to get um, well, on the way to go look to buy some shit potentially, potentially not, potentially yes. I want to buy like a wrist chain, like a diamond wrist chain, similar to like what I got now. I don't know if you've seen it. This, but well, that's obviously just gold. And then I don't know what she wants to get, but yeah. So I ended up getting a, a little wrist chain, um, like a bracelet. Yeah, so it's sterling silver and it has like crystals on it, which are like called, I think, zirconians. I believe it looks sick. 
the silver is actually held shiny and like the diamonds or the crystal sorry actually looks sick as well and it's actually really cheap oh my god all right we'll get it good afternoon all right so i had to do a quick pit stop get some strawberry and nutella whatever it is oh yeah guys this wrist this wrist chain looks sick i'll show you guys when i get home obviously we were there for like legit an hour i couldn't decide whether to get the gold or the silver I, um, the only reason I think I didn't get the gold is because, you know, after like a year or so, the gold might start fading and then it'll sort of look a bit stupid. But the gold would have matched all the rest of my jewelry, but I reckon having the silver just makes it look like hell shiny. Put some Nutella on that. I can't. Whoa. That's so nice. There it is, cuz. What's in there, bro? There's like a little bell you ring to call them, and then they come here. I'm gonna get a spritz app roll. And I don't know, what are you getting? Same getting two of them. So just got something from the wine window. Oh, cuz. I got some food, what's that? Tomato, spinach, and mozzarella. So, started walking away back to the hotel. And now we're walking the other way because we're going to get some dessert, which is affogato. And if you don't know what that is, it's pretty much an espresso shot and ice cream. So there's a little place that sells it and it looks hell good. That's the second one I've seen. And Pinocchio. Um, but yeah, they sell it and it's like hell popular on TikTok and stuff. So we're going to head there, try it out and yeah, it should be good. Ain't no way that's the whole line, bro. Is this the original? Yes. Vanilla ice cream and espresso, which is, yeah, affogato. If you don't know what that is, it's like a dessert. All right, 7.30. So it's been a little while. We were just sort of chilling in the room, but um, we're going out for dinner now. We had a reservation at seven to this restaurant. Hell no, bro. Damn, look at the pina colada. Obviously got to get a red. Oh shit, hold up. Oh shit, yeah. So we've got our food. She got spaghetti and I got a side of potatoes with this steak. Look how big it is. Cooked to perfection. It was so big, like bigger than my head. No joke. Brother, look at that. <laughs> you know the vibes, lad. All right, so the day currently is, I think it's day 15 today. And we're off to the le Leaning Tower of Pisa. Our train leaves at like 8.50. The time currently is 7.30. We've had a shower and stuff, so we're all ready to go pretty much. Just got to get dressed. But um, I think, yeah, we'll go get something to eat. And then um, head to the train -o. I see, let's see. Ooh. Sunflowers, you can't really see. Can I do that a little bit? We made it to Pisa. And how far have we walked? 23, 23 minutes to get to the actual like, leading tower, so. Guess we're about to be on our trek. Almost there. But I tell you what, this heat is, and like all this walking is so annoying, man. Especially with these like floors, like you trip over every second like tile thing in the bob. And I feel like the leading tower of Pisa is just gonna be so underwhelming. Like we're gonna get there, look at it, be like, oh well, and then leave. Like it's not gonna be like the Colosseum where it's like, holy shit, like it's sick. 
What? Does it stink? Oh, fuck. Here we are. It's actually pretty cool. It's actually bigger than I thought it was going to be. And like, fuck, you don't, you don't notice, but the photos don't do it justice on how like actual length it is. Like it actually is on like almost a 45. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like that actually is like on the piss big time. Everyone's getting the, the hold up photos. Look, oh my God. <laughs> That's going to be me though. Oh no. She's on photo duty. Oh, bro. She's going to get mad at me if I put that in the film. What I don't understand is like, how did they not notice that it was that much on the piss, bro? Like, it's, look, my phone's level. And you can say, no, no, you're right. Yeah, okay. And like, you can see, like, you would have noticed that straight away. I don't know. But um, yeah, wow, okay. It's time to leave. It's actually pretty cool. It's just fucking too hot, bro, too hot. It's like 38 degrees. I'm like sweat sweating and dripping and just... It's probably the most Aussie thing I've had here. In Frankfurt, in like a roll thing with chips and tomato sauce or ketchup. <laughs> Here's something we're familiar with, Subway. I wonder how hectic it would be here. They'd probably have like prosciutto and like fucking whatever else they got. Unless the things are just the exact same. That's fucking bullshit. That's like $10. Not even $10. But that'd be a six, six inch, but. Italian, That's handy. Yeah, no, nah, they're, they're actually. Italian BMTs, what I get? Yeah, the um, menu actually looks the exact same, eh? Except you can get an espresso. <laughs> well, I think you, you might be able to eat in Australia too. Finally made it back to Florence. Pizza was pretty cool, but you legit. You can only sort of go there for an hour or two hours, like there's nothing to do there besides look at that one thing. So, on the way back. Oh shit. Oh shit, hang on, what's that? Oh, oh, oh shit. I'm going back to the jeweler where I got it from, just because one of the clips is like a little bit too open and it's like, there's like two sort of locking mechanisms. It's one way you just push it in and it's like a latch and it just shuts on itself. And then there's two little clips that you push over like a bowl, um, but one of them is a little bit loose, so it kind of just opens up if you like shake your hand around kind of thing. So just going back there to sort of get that sorted out and maybe take out a couple links because it's quite thick. Yeah. So currently on the way to get dinner, outfit checks. I don't know if you can see them, hopefully. Outfit check, outfit check. Looking a bit bright tonight. But where are we going? Um, that place. What's it say? Grande Nutri. 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 I don't know how you'd say that. Nutri. Probably Nutri. But anyway, every restaurant we've been to so far has been good, so high hopes for this. Thanks to her for booking them. But especially the place we went last night where I got that steak, that was like actually hectic. Hectic, so tonight should be good as well. As usual, I'll try to get some clips when we're at the restaurant, when the food arrives and stuff. And yeah, see you when we get there. Bro, look how small this is, man. That's legit like you could barely, it's, oh, it's like a motorbike, but it's got like a thing around it. I thought it was a car, but it's not, it's like a motorbike. So I've got to get videos of dinner and photos. I've got photos, but not videos. I'll put some up now. Oh, look what we stumbled across, bro. Chocolate. 
brother, what the hell? Alright lads, and lettuce. Jumping on here real quick. Today's our last night in Florence, so it's actually 11 o'clock at the moment, and we leave at 11 p.m., and we leave at 11 a.m. tomorrow, and then we head to Rome. So this will be the last sort of clip you see of Florence. But, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed Florence as much as we did. But yeah, Rome should be good. I'll see you when we get there. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and comment and subscribe. Please.